Hi, this is Dr. Janet Hall, and this is a video in my series, Move On to the Highest Mountains. This video is about the Earth's most powerful tool, and that tool is precession, something most people aren't too familiar with. Well, the definition of precession is an oscillating motion like that of a spinning top. It is one of the natural earth movements resembling the wobbling of a spinning object. Well, the earth wobbles like a toy top. And what happens to the top as it spins over time? Well, it falls over when it slows down. And after the Earth has rotated on its axis over millions of years, its circle of rotation widens. And when it widens, the weight at the poles gets too heavy for the wider circle of spin. This means that the poles become top-heavy, and the Earth eventually turns upside down and starts spinning all over again. The Earth's axis is like the axis on a toy top. Actually, any axis keeps an object balanced when it's in motion. Just like this tightrope walker, he uses his arms as his axis of balance. Well, when the circle of a spinning object widens, it wobbles more. And when it wobbles more, its axis drops. So when an object is spinning like a toy top, a tightrope walker, or the earth, it shifts to maintain its balance. Today, the earth has a wider circle of rotation and the axis at the poles has dropped. This is one reason why we are experiencing strange weather, an increase in volcanic eruptions, more flooding, sinkholes, and stronger earthquakes and storms worldwide. Now let's talk about the magnetic poles because it's commonly known that the magnetic poles flip or reverse and they flip internally, and this means there's no physical movement involved. But the geographic north and south poles is a little bit different. When they shift or flip, we experience drastic physical changes. The effects can result in species extinction. And research shows that the North and South Poles did flip 65 million years ago, and this resulted in the extinction of the dinosaur. We have always been taught that the Earth's axis is 23 and a half degrees off of the vertical. But today, after 65 million years of spinning and wobbling with precession, our planet is slipping on its axis. By the year 2000, the Earth's axis had dropped approximately one half of a degree. The tilt of the axis is continuing to slowly drop day by day and year by year. This results in more intense sunlight, changes in global weather patterns, changes in the jet stream, shifting of the ocean currents, an increase in earthquakes and stronger earthquakes, an increase in volcanic eruptions, global warming, more tsunamis, an increase in larger hurricanes and stronger tornadoes. 
This will permanently alter the weather on Earth. And these changes will increase over time. There is nothing humans can do to stop this. The only thing we can do is prepare for the changes. And that's a good thing. It's very important to understand the difference between pollution and the damage that humans have done to the environment and the differences between the natural earth changes that are caused by precession. We are witnessing all of these changes today. So, hold on. We're in for the ride of our lives.